Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we have a really fun treat for you. We are taking a boat out to Cabbage Key. And if you are familiar with the Jimmy Buffett song, Cheeseburger in Paradise, uh, this restaurant is what that song's about. So we're gonna go out there and have this whole Cheeseburger in Paradise experience. And we're so excited to share it with you guys. What do you think about going on a boat today? It's gonna be cool. Just so you guys know, we're starting out at the South Seas Island Resort. It's at the northernmost tip of Captiva Island, which is about a 45 minute drive from the Fort Myers Airport in Florida. There is a trolley from the South Seas Island Resort into the, the town of Captiva. At this point in our day, it's about 9 a.m. So the trolley was not operating yet, but there was this nice shuttle. Ooh, a party bus. 20 minutes. Oh, you guys are going by the Jensen's Marina probably over there. Alright, we're here with Aunt Grace, Uncle Bart, cousins, Evelyn, and Wesley. Hi you guys, are you excited? Yeah, we're gonna see dolphins today? Maybe. Yeah. Now it is time to walk. We're almost there. Um, the shuttle only takes you to uh, a certain point and then from there you can walk. We're going down to Captiva Cruises. The nearest landmark we are familiar with is the Bubble Room, which is a really cool restaurant here at Captiva that has like um, all this really neat like old timey kitsch. All right, here's our turn. Going down Andy. Rossi, that's where we turn, right past the bubble room. And it looks like we're at McCarthy's Marina. That's where we're going, Raleigh. We're going to Cabbage Key. Cool. I'm guessing it's this one because that's what I see parked out there, right? This was our first time doing Captiva Cruises, and I guess correctly, we did ride the Lady Chadwick to Cabbage Key. If you're planning on doing this particular cruise out to Cabbage Key or Yusepa, uh, just know that it is a full day. I don't know if I highly recommend it for kids just because it's a lot of sitting and a lot of history, but um, I'm glad we did it just because I don't know when we'll be back to Captiva. It might be a couple years. So uh, for us, it was a fit. It just depends on your kids and, and their temperament. For us, this cruise was especially fun because we got to do it with Jesse's family. The whole crew is here. Hi, Riley. Hey, Daddy. <laughs> Sometimes when you go on vacation with family, you guys kind of go off and do your separate things, but when you're all on a boat together, it's a shared experience. So I definitely recommend this for you know large groups that are looking for a fun outing together. And um, this is cool because you can see the South Seas Island Resort as we headed out to Cabbage Key. And uh, here is a cool shot that I got of the Lady Chadwick from the perspective of the South Seas Island pools. So that's kind of fun. And um, yeah, it was really neat. We had an amazing uh, guide who shared with us so much of the history of this region. One of the dollar bills <clears throat> is framed right behind the bar and it's signed by a very popular singer, Jimmy Buffett. And Jimmy Buffett used to hang out here before he got really well known. Jimmy Buffett wrote a very popular song called Cheeseburger in Paradise. So enjoy the island experience from Jamila and Cabbage Key folks. And then when you arrive at Cabbage Key, I highly recommend going straight to get your cheeseburger in paradise because you don't have a lot of time on the island. The boat takes off at 1.30 sharp in this particular cruise. So we had lunch and we learned that Cabbage Key is named for the cabbage palm trees that are native to this region.
All right. Yeah, Wesley, high five. Yeah. All right, so right when we got off the boat, we went straight to get our cheeseburgers in paradise. Uh, Jesse and I actually got the grouper. We've been wanting to do grouper all week, and it was so good, it was so tender. But the cheeseburgers were also amazing. We um, stole a bite of some of the kids. And um, Raleigh, of course, I packed her like some bread rolls and some grapes. And um, I also have some gluten-free Oreos for her because it's a long day with no, no kitchen. If you have celiac, um, of course, it's not safe to eat here at this kitchen. Uh, but it's a really cool sight to see. And now we're gonna climb up the water tower because this is one of the other things to do when you're at Cabbage Key. Monkey's in the water tower. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. It just hit her, I think she looked out. It's so uh, high when you look out, huh, Raleigh? Look at this. Are these the cabbage palm trees, I wonder? Should we go on the trail for a little bit, Raleigh? Yeah, I don't recognize them, they're like kind of these little ones. Palms. I don't know. That's what they said the place is named for, the yeah. cabbage palms. Good thing we had, we're reading the menu. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, so there's the docks. So that's our way back. Okay, Raleigh? So pretty. Bring your bug spray. We ran into someone on the trail that said, take trail B, right? Because trail A is a dead end. So we'll see what happens. You do? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. Hey Wesley, I see it. You guys, there's a snake in the swamp. Wouldn't want to encounter a snake. I don't want to get in this water. All these neat little cabins out here. Wow, Raleigh, do you see all of this foliage? So amazing. All right, so the boat leaves at 1.30, so we're gonna turn back. We couldn't do the full loop. This has been a lot of fun, you guys. Thank you so much for joining us today to explore Cabbage Key for the first time. Um, if you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. It helps us more than you know, and I will see you later in Super Cali Land. Bye! Captain Glenn and Captain Eric Alvis and Captain Tita Cruz, I want to thank you so much. Folks, a pleasure to be out of the water with you today. We truly appreciate 
spend your day with us. So thank you so much. Safe travels and hope to see you back, folks. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you. Thank you.